G'day, it's Ben Smith here. I've got my mates Aaron and Jack to practice the high ball, so I'm just going to show you a few skills and a few techniques to help you out with that. One of the first steps for the high ball is to get in good position early. You really want to make sure that you're keeping on, on where the ball's going and then uh, your approach steps are, are really big. So if you can get to the space where you think the high ball's going to come down, that can give you a good approach into the high ball. Next step, you want to make sure you have small steps as you approach the ball. So you want to make sure that you're always keeping your eye on the ball and then you're just going to take small steps and then you're going to go up and approach the ball and get ready for that contest. Okay, so I've got my mate Aaron here and Jack. Jack's going to be on the turtle and Aaron's going to be simulating a kick. So we talked about those small steps. So I want to make sure that we're taking those small steps and then we're really going hard into that contact. So you want to bring your knee up nice and high and always keep an eye on that ball that we talked about. That's the main point. So uh, here we go, Nuggy. So he's going to simulate one. So just up and then just coming through. So your knee's always leading. That'll help you when it comes to that contest in the air with the other player. Always keep your eye on the ball. So that's it guys, there's my three steps. The first step is tracking where that ball is so you can get in a good position. The next tip is just to make sure that we're getting those small steps, always keeping our eye on the ball. And the third step is we want to be nice and powerful as we get into the contact, making sure that our knees nice and high, arms are nice and high. We're really being dominant in that collision. Just keep your eye on that ball and you'll have great success. Cheers.